now that we've got models in place the next thing we need to do is or the next thing I want to do is we want to add some files to the repositories so these are kind of the interfaces that um, will talk or allow us to talk to the database or connect to the databases read and write data and what we're going to use we're going to use JPA uh, for this and the reason is it's really easy and simple to get something up and running and as you can see here here's one that I created earlier for task repository so this uh, gives us like the read and write access um, for reading and, and writing data and updating data in the table that relates to tasks so to um, show you how easy it is what we want to do, we want to go to repositories because that's where we're going to put them we're going to right click and we're going to go new Java class or it's going to be an interface and we're going to call this one employee and uh, let's add I like to add at least on the individual repository just to say what it is Sorry. Um, so we add that and obviously we need to have um, its packages the repositories now if you look all we need to do is firstly want to extend from the JT JPA repository and then we give it the type and we give it the um, the type of the ID so we're going to say this this one extends JPA repository and as I say the type is for this one it's going to be employee because that's what that's what it is it's an employee type and as I say we want to pass in the type of the ID so if we went to the employee we see the ID is a lung so this would be a lung And there we go as you can see it's very simple very similar so if I can save that off and that's the repository um, file for employees added or employee added and as I say this because we're extending JPA repository JPA repository has the read and the write um, and access ex uh, and all that kind of the, the the very basic access that you'd expect so straight out of the box as it were we've got that access and then the only things you would actually add are kind of maybe you've got some extra um, you know you want to extend on the particular uh, read and write access maybe you want to do particular things with the data before you write it and then, then you'd extend on it but otherwise um, as it is now you can create add data to the employee database uh, table and the same with the task so that's repository files created